auditorio.
Good evening. Hello, hello. Good evening. Just Good evening. give me one moment. Good evening, Adita, Lourdes, Sulma, y todos los que están conectados. Good evening, Teacher, Good evening. Angie. Hello, hello. Good evening. Can you hear me? Yes, yes teacher. Okay, just a moment. Let me turn on the camera because I need to enter in the other device. Device. What is divide in Spanish teachers? <laughs> um, that's a nice question. Device, it's in that case, the, the other device that I'm going to use, let's see. Yeah, the one that I'm going to use is the, the phone, right? So I'm in the phone in the other. Oh, so okay. device, it's not phone, okay? Device, it's dispositivo, right? Puede ser una otra computadora, puede ser una tablet, puede ser an, a phone, so that can be a device, okay? So okay, now Thank I'm you. into devices, so in case if something happened, you know that I'm connected in the in the phone as well. So do you know how how do you say phone? We say cell phone, right? Cellular, right? We say cell phone, but do you know um, similar work that we can use instead of just uh, say uh, phone, phone, cell phone? Alguien sabe cómo decir teléfono sin decir teléfono? <laughs> How do you say phone without saying phone? Uh -huh. uh, how do you say mobile in English, teacher? So that would be mobile phone. Mobile phone. Uh -huh. Mobile phone. So phone is teléfono, right? So, pero nosotros decimos celular o teléfono móvil. So that would be mobile phone. Pero hay otra palabra para decir teléfono celular. Uh -huh. Nadie. No teacher. No teacher. I don't know. Handset. Okay. You can say handset. You can say phone, cell phone, handset. even cellular. Handset. I guess you can say cellular um, device. The device. device. The, the device. device. The handset. My goodness, no cameras today. ¿Qué han hecho al fin de semana que no se quieren dejar ver? Anda de pelado. Take me a moment, please, because I am in this Eating. moment. I have my dinner. Yes. Mm -hmm. I, I noticed that. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Enjoy your food. Thank you. No problem. Thank you. Then the rest, my goodness, I have messages right here. What's going on? Margarita. Okay, Margarita. So, and the rest, Ophelia, Osmin. Osmin, ¿qué le pasa, Osmin? Why you are, you don't have the camera today, Osmin? What's going on? Hey, ah, oh, you are in your job, okay? Good evening, yes, Osmin. Yeah, I know you are That's in your me. job. Yes. Okay, no problem. Thank you, Rafael. Nice, welcome. Sulma, what happened with your camera? 
Uh, Ophelia, Sandra, Jancy, nice. Thank you, Jancy. Welcome. Ya les dije que no importa que estemos ahí despe despeinados y mechudos. Ya, ya sí somos, ya. What else? We can... Así que ya. No, mal, teacher, así una media ahí. No, hasta... <risa> Solo para <risa> qué. Ya, bien, apenas lunes y yo ya con ojeras. Pero bueno. Del fin de semana tan cansado que nos toca las mujeres, teacher. Tan... Ya. Los lunes para mí es más cansado. Ya, yeah, I know. I know. Uh, let's see. Ophelia, Ophelia, Ana, Ana. What happened with Ana Michelle? Sandra. I am dinner teacher. Okay, I am having or I am eating, right? So I am eating right now, presente continuo, right? So I am eating. Si usted me dice, I'm dinner, yo cena, right? So ahí falta el verbo to be, okay? I am having dinner, okay? I am eating my dinner, okay? Thank you, Ophelia, nice. So let's see, ¿quién más falta? My goodness, solo vemos... 14. Hello, Darwin. Why you are so serious today? <laughs> Hoy viene Hello. serio, dice, dice eh, Darwin, para que nadie lo moleste. Hoy viene él serio. <laughs> muchos lo molestan, muchos lo molestan. Ok. Hello, teacher. Hello, Ana. Michelle, Hello. what happened? Ah, um, I'm driving to home, so oh I can't connect. <laughs> o sea, no me voy a poder conectar ahorita. Voy okay. a estar como oyente. Okay, okay, okay. So I have a couple of messages right here. Let me see. Yes. No sé quién me mandó. No, este me mandó. Pero ya no alcancé a escuchar. Es que estaba... Estaba en una reunión, entonces me salí de la reunión y me vine para acá, por eso es que este no había encendido la cámara porque en el, la, estaba ocupando el otro device. Excuses van a decir ustedes. <risa> no, it's not excuse, it's true. Estoy en, no, un, semi, en un seminario de... Uh, ¿Cómo diría yo le creo? I, I believe on you. I believe, I believe. I believe on you. Creo en usted. I believe, I on, believe you. on you. Thank you. Thank sí, you. Sir. Thank you, Angela. Sí, estaba en una meeting desde las Darwin, 7. Ya le di la cara. Sí, Darwin, la, la Darwin. está molestando. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Después, cuando lo empezamos a molestar a él. <risa> Yo creo que se está vengando, desquitando. Sí, la venganza es mala, Darwin. Es mala la venganza. Ya, yeah, uh, was in a meeting seems like seven. Y no, no ha terminado, termina a las 8.30, pero I already I left the meeting. Oh, oh, y, o sea, estaba en la reunión y se pueden imaginar, preparándome el café. Eh, this is not my room, this is my baby room. Mm, Entonces okay. me, vengo, me vengo del cuarto de los míos, porque ahí tengo mi escritorio y todo, right Pero... Como un niño le da sueño y ahí duerme en el cuarto, entonces mejor me vengo yo aquí, me encierro yo en este cuarto y así me lo duermen a él ya ahí en su camita. Entonces, mm. por eso es que vengo aquí, que ven que hay cosas de baby y eso, porque este es el cuarto de él, pero allá duerme conmigo. <risa> entonces, este... Toda una ver. gran mamá. Ya, yeah, I have to. Entonces me tocó andar alistando todo, le, le dejo lista la pijama y todo para que le pongan la pijamita. Le de, la, ha estado como con gripita, la medicina, le eché las gotitas en la nariz. Sí, es que por poco pensé que no llegaba a tiempo. Pero no bueno, problem, no problem. Creo, que, creo que you understand what I mean, especially Darwin. Yes. Él ya pasó Hoy, por esa. Sí, ya Darwin nos, uh, Darwin nos puede eh, dar escuela aquí, como se hacen las cosas de mamá. Porque... Okay. Eh, Admirable Darwin. Ya, yeah, definitely, definitely. Miren que, I don't know what happened. I got disconnected from the other device. 
Voy a volver a meter. Pero la escuchamos y la vemos, teacher. Yeah, pero I'm, I always like, I like to be like in two devices, porque imagínense se va el internet de repente, pum, o algo. So, aquí estoy ya. Um, I have plan B, but if I'm just in one phone, los pierdo por completo, entonces se corta el video, right? My goodness, Rosa Elena, you are here, welcome. Oh my goodness. Hello, good evening. You look different this Monday. Yes. <laughs> Did you do something in your hair? No. Not really? Maybe I'm... I comb my hair. <laughs> no, yeah, probably no. you comb your hair in a different yeah, way. Probably. Mm -hmm. probably. 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 <laughs> there you go. Okay, Rosalena, how do you say phone without saying phone? <laughs> synonym <What>? work. <laughs> a synonym, synonym work for phone? Um, phone. We say phone or we say mobile phone, right? My goodness, I don't know. Phone <laughs> without phone. Yeah, like a synonym word. How do you say cell phone? Ah, like a synonym on cell phone. <gasps> um, I don't know. Let me make it up. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we okay. say we we because uh, we was we were like saying device oh, yeah. device is like a technology it's not just the phone can be a laptop yes. can be a tablet uh, yes. but can a be a, can be a handset handset yes, teacher sir. yes Lord. can you write the, this word please okay just a moment thank you Just a moment. Okay, now we are 16. Ya vamos llegando, ya vamos llegando. Mm -hmm. How do you say teléfono de casa? Telephone house now. No. Mm. <laughs> My goodness. Excuse me. That's you, Osmi. You have a call. Yes, excuse me. Thank you. Okay. So, uh, more mobile phone sería, I'm sorry, um, teléfono de casa, landline. Lem Home phone, no. Home phone, mm, yeah, it is home phone, but home phone. The the correct word will be um, landline. 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 Lem. Linea. Landline. ¿Cómo se escribe este chavo? Ahorita, espérenme, es que esta computadora me tiene bloque aquí, esperen. En Spanish, landline, teléfono de casa. Línea de casa. Uh -huh. Oh, it's like Línea teléfono, teléfono fijo. There you go, así decimos. Landline. Landline. Teléfono mm -hmm. fijo decimos nosotros, mm -hmm. right? Okay. Que ya no existe el teléfono fijo. No, ya no. Sí, aún. Okay. Todavía. Ah, Algunos. Casi no, casi no lo conté. <ríe> ¿Cómo se dice? Ay, ¿Cómo se dice? Lo conservo. I keep it. I keep it. I keep it. Lo, lo tengo. Ajá. Landline. Landline. Ahorita se lo voy a poner aquí. El mío se me arruinó y nunca me lo arreglaron. Así que ya no. Yeah, I remember hasta, that. Hasta el número se me, se me olvidó. <laughs> remember that in the past, 
los que tenían a uh, phone in the past era gente pudiente. ¿Se acuerdan? Iban de un vecino, uno, mira, me presta el teléfono. So, aquellos tiempos, right? O si no, de... a los teléfonos de público. Ya. Yeah. De moneda. <risas> de moneditas. Después los cambiaron a tarjeta, right? Yes. When I was when I was a child, I was I was very exciting. The the I was very exciting when when we when we get the the landline. <laughs> Mm -hmm. Yeah, I it say, was. Oh my God, I have a telephone in my house. <laughs> yeah, that was very, very important at, at yeah. those point, right? My goodness, there are more words that are ones that I thought. Lamb line. My goodness, thank you. Handset, aquí está el que yo les quiero decir. Handset. So that's wireless, wireless phone, teléfono inalámbrico. O sea, el wireless, ahí está, mire, um, and, quiero ver, lo wordes, right? Handset. Wireless phone es el celular nowadays, right? Antes había teléfono inalámbrico, ¿se acuerdan? Que antes uno tenía que estar pegado con la pita, pero de repente ya no, right? So you have the teléfono inalámbrico y si vos te a la calle a hablar para que el vecino lo viera que tenía teléfono eh, wireless, right? So después vinieron los cell phones, right? Los cellular phones y andaba el gran ladrillo, uno bueno, yo no, no, no lo tuve, pero tal vez yo alguien tampoco, de ustedes pues. vio a sus papás o alguien sacaba la antena y ponía el gran teléfono que había que cargarlo, right? Pero ahí va la gente pudiente con esos teléfonos, right? So nowadays it's everyone. We have a phone, but in the past that was. Yes, I got, I got my first cell phone in 1996 Imagine. or, or 1998 I don't remember exactly but I have a Motorola mm -hmm. <laughs> Motorola were the ones that you can throw it away and they were like without any scratch what is a scratch you know a scratch my phone, aha, uh -huh. quebrado, right? My phone, it's like, es, pero es que quebrado sería broken, pero broken. en este caso mi teléfono no está quebrado, sino que está rayado, dice usted. Rayado. Mire, la pantalla mm -hmm. tiene una rayita, mm -hmm. es esa rayita que usted anda, bueno, no, ustedes no, ustedes deben de andar sus teléfonos últimos modelos. Yo no, yo ahí lo ando todo, scratch. But I like it. Okay, ustedes no, medio le ven una rayita y ya lo cambian, hacen un upgrade. ¿Qué es un upgrade? Upgrade. Actualización. Actualización. Actualización, right? So, hacen un upgrade. Usted medio tiene un scratch ahí en el screen y ya va a, a fiar, no, mentiras, a comprar, right? A comprar. Hoy en el plan Yo weekend, no compro tips. allá los vi que andaban haciendo la gran fila ahí. Comprando. I'm still, la... I'm still my phone. <laughs> <laughs> comprando la, las promotions. Imagine. Ya, yeah, no. Mm. A, a, yo, cuando he, he tenido o sea, la oportunidad de teléfono, este, por ejemplo, arrecas menos de un año. But I don't like to be like paying phones. Yo siento que no. Yo, I prefer to save the money. En get it at once, porque no sé, ahora si es un teléfono caro, eh, obviamente que uno quizás no lo puede comprar, va como el iPhone que tiene ahí, ya saben ustedes quién. Este, que trabaja en la Kimberly, dice usted. Ajá, vale, ah, o vale, sea, sí. mil, mil, ¿cuánto? $1,300 here in el server, por ahí más o menos. No, esos niveles ya, ya no. Ajá, Adri Martínez. Ah, 
the company oh. today oh. results. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, ¿por qué no viniste el viernes? No quería. No quería venir a la clase. Y yo preguntando por ti que no te había visto el viernes, te fuiste a comprar las, las promociones del supermercado. Fuiste a comprar. ¿Y por qué no viniste a la clase? ¿Se te olvidó? Los niños, los niños no mienten. No, porque no se acuerda, teacher. No se acuerda que hizo el bien. No se acuerda, Matías. Ay, Matías, Matías. Bueno, let me pass the attendance, Dios mío. No hemos, no hemos pasado la attendance, por Dios. My goodness, today is Monday the 29th. Tomorrow is the last day of the month. Let's see. Ada Patricia. Present. Thank you. Adriana Stephanie. Present. Thank you. Uh, Michelle. Ahí está Michelle. Present. Driving. Thank you. Angela. Ahí está Present Angela. Teacher. Thank you. Darwin. Always there. Thank you. Nice. Flor de María. Sé que está ahí. Present teacher. Thank you. Gloria. Por ahí está Gloria. Yeah. Thank you. Yeah. Joana Patricia. No. Lourdes Beatriz. Ahí está. Present. Thank you. Sí, a comer. Uh, Margarita. I'm here. Thank you, Margarita. Mayra Melanie. Mayra Melanie fue la que present, me escribió. Present teacher. Ah, ok. So, did you send me a message, right? Yes. yes ah, ok. Teacher. Yeah, but I couldn't listen it. Ok, I'm sorry. Estaba en una meeting y, y después vi que tenía mensaje. But, but nice that you are here. Thank you, ok. Thank you. Nice. Nelson. Nelson. No, no lo he visto, Nelson. Ophelia. Yeah, it's here. Here, teacher. Thank you. Osmi. Yeah, it's here. Yeah. yeah. Thank you. Rafael. It's also here. Um, Rosa Elena. Yes, it's here. Yes. Rosita Elena. Sandra Gladys. It's here. Sandra Gladys. Thank you, Susana Carolina. No la he visto, Susana. Eh, Jan Lisbeth, yeah, it's here. Present. Thank you, and Sulma, it's also here. Present. Here. Thank you, nice. So, um, let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see. We have right here the attendance. And we are going to start, my goodness. So this is the third week. Imagine, como nada, right? So this is the third week of the course. And we are going to start the unit number three. And yeah, if we have time on Friday, we are going to complete the... Um, the midterm exam, okay? The midterm exam means like the half of the ex course exam, right? So esta semana en teoría tendríamos que terminar el, el midterm, okay? No sé si tienen las fechas que les compartí. Mm, del día del quiz, no, I'm not sure if it is this coming Friday or no, porque... Si sí me aparece en la planificación, just to make sure, porque yo me acuerdo que les di unas, unas fechas. December the third, the midterm. December de? the third. Ajá, ya ven, uh -huh. que yo no estoy mal. It's the, says... final, the final exam, December seventeen. Mm -hmm. Okay, December the 3rd. So mm -hmm. that means this week, right? So because today is the 29th. It's Friday. It's, it's Friday. Friday. 
Yay. So, ya ven, si es que yo me acuerdo que estaba revisando la planificación y puse ahí en, el, en la presentación, Mitra. So, yeah. Okay, so this coming Friday, uh, we are going to. We are going to complete the, um, the midterm exam. So uh, we will do it. Uh, we will do it together, but it's not the whole quiz, okay? So con esto no le estoy diciendo no lo haga y espere que yo porque las respuestas no las voy a dar. O sea, aquí lo vamos a hacer entre todos, right? So, but if you can do it before, it would be nice, okay? So, it would be nice. And uh, we just can validate the answers and you can validate if you got, uh, have it correctly. But you can do the quiz, uh, the exam before, okay? No, es, no esté solo, voy a esperar hasta el viernes, right? If you can do it before, so no problem, you can go ahead and do it, okay? But we will see some parts of the exam uh, on Friday, we will see it together, okay? So that's what we have. That means que unit number two tiene que estar complete, tiene que estar finalizada la unidad dos y el midterm esta semana, okay? So please don't forget, that is something that you have to do in your own okay so well let's start i don't know if you did something special during the weekend did you have a highlight do you know what is a highlight when i say highlight i go so uh -huh. no. there you go this is a highlight do you have a highlight during the weekend or so tienen algo sobresaliente, algo que usted diga, hey, qué chivo, este, me pasó esto, me encontré un, no sé, un, un billete de 100 dólares botado, eso no pasa siempre, right? So, that would be a highlight. Nunca me ha pasado, pero debe de ser bonito. <laughs> okay, I found a bill, a hundred dollars bill in the street, imagine. That would be nice, okay? So as I told you, um, I don't know, something highlight that you have? Yesterday, I went with my family to celebrate my nephew's birthdays. Ah, okay, and where did you go? We went to La Pampa del Volcán. Oh my God, that was, I guess that was delicious. Yes, but it was a breakfast. Ah, it was in the morning, but still. Yeah. Yeah. Delicious breakfast over yeah. there. It was, it was very nice. nice okay. Moment. Okay, and that is your, your nephew, you say, right? Yeah, my nephew is 21 years old. 21. Oh, nice. Okay. Okay. That's nice. And you don't go to La Pampa every weekend, right? So that was okay. an special date. Yes. Nice. Okay. Thank you, Rosa Elena. Let's see. Do we have any other highlight? No. Go to the beach. Sandra, weekend? you went to the beach during the weekend? Oh okay. my God. Okay. So, and where? Where did you go? Where exactly? Uh, Bahia de Jiquilisco. Isla okay. La Pirraya. Isla La Pirraya. My goodness. Where is that? La Isla de Jiquilisco. Where is it? Uh, Usulután. Ah, okay, Sulutan. Okay, nice. Nice. I wish I could go to the beach during the week. And a poor, I don't, I, I don't have your incomes. Okay, you know what is incomes? Incomes, I don't have your Ingresos. incomes. Ah, uh -huh, okay, so you're rich people. I don't have your incomes, okay? Nice, but it's nice, okay? Nice to enjoy with family, with friends and everything. 
Okay. Don't say that to her because someone is going to is going to kidnap. <laughs> oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Especially this and this. Uh, videos right because everything is being recorded <laughs> okay okay so look we are going to cover two two different presentations today okay so because this is something that we are been talking talking and talking but still we have to continue with just one exercise so we will cover this really quick in this first hour and then i have another presentation that we will cover today as well but let's see the idea it's to do a focus group but we will see how we can do it okay because we are going to invent and probably we will do it together okay or two groups okay i don't know so i guess it will be just one but let me see this one first. Mm, let's see. Yeah, you can see the screen right now. So, oops. So this is the this is the the the, the topic that we have testing new products conversation. So the idea is talk, okay talk about testing okay about product testing so as i told you probably in our jobs so probably we don't really do this type of activities right but we are going to try okay imagine that you work in a i don't know probably in a business company and you have to launch or a release new products right so and remember since the last unit we are talking right about production we are talking about how to develop a new product we did an activity right in which we create a product so we invent that we are going to sell something so now it's product testing okay now the idea is uh, validate if the product that we are offering or the product that we are selling it's you know affordable it's good it's uh you know well received by the customers okay so i don't know if i have any volunteer that can tell me what do you understand with the work product testing so when we see product testing uh, what comes to your mind? What do you think about this? Any volunteer? Me, teacher. Please go ahead. For example, uh, at my work, at my at the company, uh, we we bought uh, what bought or buy? We buy a product uh, for demo. Can you say demo? Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. yeah. When arrives the uh, the line. Oh my God! How do you say here in the line? The line manager or like the manager. Mm -hmm. The manager. Uh -huh, the manager of, of the the line of the product. Uh, uh, oh, how can I say? <laughs> Made the the request. The request. To, mm. the, to the warehouse okay uh, to, mm -hmm. to testing the product uh, in some cases cameras control access access control access control mm -hmm. access uh, control uh, head, headsets 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 um car, access card access and cards there are many mm -hmm. many things of product that they they test mm -hmm. and who, they, who, they, who, who because, do the huh? testing who oh, do the, the testing the manager of the el gerente de la línea que es experto o oh, en todo caso uh -huh. técnico the technicians mm -hmm. the technicians mm -hmm. yeah but they are from the company right yes they are from the company mm -hmm. but sometimes we we have certain products that we if you are a client 
and we can say I give you and prove it for mm -hmm. two days. Testings, okay. Testing, so that yeah. is like mm -hmm. testing products that you just have it just for free, right? So yeah. you have the, the, the day or the couple of dates to use it and mm -hmm. then say, okay, yeah, like yes. it, give me mm -hmm. 10. Yes. Mm -hmm. Okay, yes. interesting, interesting, right? Okay, nice, perfect. Um, I don't know if somebody else work with something like this, like uh, Rosa, that it's like, in a company where you purchase different um, equipment, right? So in this case will be equipment or different type of products that you have to test or validate. Alguien trabaja así como algo que compren algo en la empresa, ajá, Zulma. In my workplace, we have a team of quality uh, tea and they in charge of testing new application or updates in the uh, online bank. Ah, okay. So there is a, a IT, right? IT, IT group. Department. Department. Yes. Okay. Yeah. They have like the bank app, right? So yes. the application for the bank. Ah, okay, so they are like testing, using, probably they are receiving uh, complaints from customers or something, right? That says that it's something is not working and they are working on that to make sure and validate that. Yeah. Okay, perfect. So if you see in every business, we need to test the product, right? So for example, if you work with Clothes, for example, if you work in a clothes store, as an example, so I guess the people that work it at the store, they have to check if the clothes it's okay. No, I vender hay una camisa con un gran hoyo, right? So they have to validate, review, and check that the clothes is, you know, perfect. It's in good condition. So in order for them to sell it. So every single product, okay? Like food, for example. So no nos vamos a ir a, a lo, in my a lo más. Happened. Uh -huh. What happened to you? It so happened because, because is there a, a, lab, a lab and made the medicine. And sometimes they probably with us. <laughs> okay. mm -hmm. they, give, they give us, um, ¿cómo se dice? Muestras? Uh, like testing, they give you like, just okay. like a testing proof. Okay, and, and use with that when the product have, when the product um, makes many many time um, is para su estabilidad. No, es que hay palabras técnicas que no las puedo decir. Cuando el producto mm -hmm. está ya ha cumplido un montón de de pruebas químicas. Mm -hmm. And what kind of that. what kind of product? Did they test with you as an example? Okay. Mention one like vitamins, um, procaina one time, sometimes, um, medicine for for stomach. Oh my goodness, no. and it's and it's like an obligation for you to drink it. What it is like a like an obligation. I no, 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 no. Hey, o sea, they say, o sea, antes de lanzar el producto, um, they have, um, their price is more. It's cheaper. O sea, it's more offer. Yes. And you buy the product sometimes. Or there, they give you. You mm -hmm. say, oh, I have, I have a, um, a headache. And they say, I take that. And they make a control. Mm -hmm. Okay, look, interesting, right? Interesting. Just be careful, okay? Just be careful. No le vayan a dar ahí algo que, que no. As I told you, in other countries, no, o no, sea, no, no, hay hasta, hasta películas de eso, hay, right? No sé si han visto, pero imagínense que hagan la prueba, no sé, en alguna cosa. La como... mujer araña. 
ajá, ¿verdad? Que hay una película, algo así, que, que prueban en ella y el gran transformación. So, my goodness, be careful, be careful. Pero that, that's testing, ¿ok? That's testing, ¿ok? Testing, ¿ok? When they do something and they want to see if the product is working. Ok, nice. So you see how important is this topic, product testing, because uh, as I told you, even with food, ok, if you go, for example, um, Olocuilta, I guess more, more, most of you are from San Salvador, La Libertad, so you know uh, that place, right, the Olocuilta really famous because of the pupusas, right? But I am 100% sure that you have a place, okay? Probably if it is the first time that you go to Olocuilta, so you go to any place, usted va donde le llaman, le dice, venga mi amor, aquí le tenemos para llevar, para que ahí se mete, right? So because that is probably the first time, but as soon as you eat the pupusas, so you test, Right, usted dice aquí no volvemos a venir. O viene usted y o dice bye. Siempre que vayamos a lo cuilta vamos a venir aquí donde la niña Carmencita. So you have the place, okay? So if it is the second, third time that you go to lo cuilta, so and you are a customer from lo cuilta, you know where to go. Se no va cualquiera, o sea, la que le llaman. Usted va donde x pupusería que usted ya la probó, right? So that is uh, testing, right? So testing. And that is with everything, okay? With shoes, for example. In my case, I'm sorry if someone works right here in MD, but I don't like those shoes, okay? I don't like MD, and it's really famous. MD is really famous. And I'm sorry si alguien le gusta esa, esa marca, pero. I have bad and negative experience with those, those shoes because they are expensive. They are not cheaper. No crean que valen 10 pesos. The shoes, uh, shoes over there are really, really, really expensive. How do, you I, say, how do you say uh, que no duran mucho? <laughs> yeah, they don't work. They don't work. That's that. That happened to me. I remember I purchased two pairs of shoes one like sandal shoes and the other ones were like you know casual formal foods uh shoes i'm sorry and then uh i used it like two times and in the third time i was without shoes at the street en la calle me quedé sin zapatos <laughs> so can you imagine so Yo dije jamás Mi ni nunca vuelvo a comprar un par de zapatos en esa tienda. Me too, me, 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 me too. <laughs> yeah, that happened to you from MD as well, uh, Angel. Yeah, and lichos. <laughs> lichos, but lichos, it's a little better. Me quedé en dos ocasiones con los zapatos nuevos en descalza. Literalmente descalza. Pasé en las calles así. <risa> oh my God, the match. Eso, eso jamás se me va a olvidar. Es una cosa que <risa> terrible. Y un par de zapatos nuevos. <risa> embarrassing moments. De, yeah, um, really yes. Sí, yeah. ya me quedé ahí inmóvil, ahí solo con, el, con, la, so, con el, la hebilla aquí agarrado de mi tobillo y el zapato totalmente. <risa> Se deshacen, I don't know desde, why. Ajá, y luego los mandé a arreglar, ¿verdad? Y me vuelve a pasar lo mismo y tenía que pasar dos calles, solo pasé la primera y la segunda y se me vuelve a, a desarmar totalmente y paso la calle, me quito el otro y pasé descalza porque ni modo más que eran altos. Como... Así que me pasó. Oh my God. Yeah, y yo, I believe y yo sudando you. con una gran vergüenza y roja y dice el señor, solo en los eventos de belleza había visto eso, dice yo, ay Dios mío. Oh my God, oh my God, yeah, ah, poor Angel, oh my no, goodness. But, but yo... I understand, in my case, it happened almost the same, but the good thing is that it was at night. 
So I was <laughs> in the university and it was raining. Okay, it was raining. Really? Oh, no. So <laughs> I was walking, okay, at that at that time when I was at the university, I traveled by bus. Chuzón, right? So I get, a, get out from the from the mic with from the bus and then I start walking, okay, and it was raining. Cuando los zapatos se me mojaron como que eran de papel, se me and it was I was walking with the shoes, no, si, but it si was no, it eh. was late. It was late, so yo me iba por donde estaba oscurito para que nadie me viera. Pero it was yep. like that. <laughs> Se iban así, like as soon as they get wet, so suddenly the shoes were like I don't know, scratching. Then suddenly the shoes were disappearing. So, so oh, me quedé yeah. como un pedacito de arriba, but I was so embarrassed, but it happened. So sí. that's why I always say, please don't get those day shoes. No, they don't, they don't work. No. And don't, don't, yeah. do not think on fixing them, okay? Ustedes se los voy a llevar a que me los arreglen. Peor, gasta y no sirve, okay? No so, sirve. Yeah, we are talking about this because we are talking about testing, okay? <laughs> no es que solo nos estemos riendo. That's the topic, right? Testing uh, uh, product, yeah? Ahorita nos estamos riendo, pero pasamos una gran sudada. Yo, por ejemplo, escurría. Ay, Dios mío, quería enterrarme, quería, no sé, cualquier <laughs> Ojalá que no me vuelva a encontrar esta persona que va pero todo el mundo le va viendo a uno. Y yo, ay, más el señor hace su comentario y me queda viendo. Solo en los eventos de vida se había visto eso. Que... Ay, no. Oh my God, ya. Yeah. No, that's, that's really fue terrible, terrible para mí, trauma, traumante. Yeah, now, nowadays, when I think on get a choose. So I always look for a different brand, okay? Busco, tampoco no de 200 dólares, right? Pero busco un zapato que yo diga que me va a durar porque I don't know why. Yo no soy buena con los zapatos. A mí no me, no me dura. But that happened, okay? So product me testing. Too, me too, teacher, me too. <laughs> My goodness. Ay, no. Let's see, let's see. We have this, okay? So definition that is, uh, let's see, uh, Osmi, help us. Could you please help us reading this uh, stage three cons concept testing, okay? The definition, Osmi, please. Okay, teacher. Kiss me, one moment, please. Definition, concept testing or market testing is the process of using quantitative method and qualitative methods to evaluate consumer res response, response to a product idea prior, prior, prior to the introduction of a product to the market, yes. Mm, okay, thank you, Oswin, perfect. Uh, let's see, um, let's see, let's see, let's see. Uh, Rafael, please help us uh, continue with the reading, please. Evaluations of such measures as consumers' relevance. Okay. Evaluation on such measure as consumer relevance. How important is the consumer need being addressed by the innovation? Consumer purchase interest and dissatisfaction with currently available products are used to prioritize ideas for further testing, evaluation, and funding. Okay, thank you. Nice. 
So let's see the definition that we have right here. It says concept testing that will be market testing. So that what we are talking, right? Testing the product. It says right here, that is the process of using quantitative. We have that in Spanish, right? Quantitative. So quantitative method and qualitative, okay? The qualitative method, okay? Quantitative y qualitative, right? To evaluate consumers, okay? Consumers response to a product idea prior to introduction of a product to the market, okay? So that's what we are talking, okay? That's lo que estamos hablando, right? So the idea is evaluate, okay? You as a customer, we are always customers, okay? Direct or indirect, we are customers of something. And sometimes we are loyal too. I don't know if you are loyal to a brand. Do you know what is a brand? Marca. Marca, okay. So this is something related to this, okay? Because when we are using a product, sometimes it's because we like it, right? We choose the product, okay? A nadie lo pueden, le pueden obligar a comprar algo que no le gusta, right? So ahora si se lo regalan es otra cosa, right? Uno dice, well, me lo regalaron, lo voy a usar, right? But I don't like it. But if you get the, if you have the money, um, you are thinking on get something. So sometimes we have a brand. Do you have any a specific brand that you always use or that you always purchase, that you always wear in any product? Piensa en alguna marca que le gusta y que usted dice, no compro otro, siempre tiene que ser este. For example, my daughter, mm -hmm. always, always about Saba. <laughs> Saba, ah, okay. Yes. Okay. I can, I can mention uh, another brand. No, no, no. It doesn't exist. <laughs> okay, imagine, yeah. so she's loyal to that brand. So yeah. probably, probably she already passed this testing process, okay? Because you don't have a product like an special or a specific product if you haven't used it, right? Once you use the product, once you test, so you take your decisions, right? And then you say, no, Saba is the best. No, but we have a uh, cotton. No, we don't like that one, okay? So I want this ones, okay? So you see, we have customers like that, okay? We have people that is loyal too. For example, with, um, I don't know if you have teenagers, but for teenagers, um, like for 15 to 17, 18 years old. So le, usted le dice a uno de estos bichos, mira, te voy a regalar este par de zapatos del mercado. So eso fue una ofensa, right? So no, they want Nike, okay? Nike, okay? So they are Nike lovers, Adidas lovers, so the brand. Ellos saben de marca, usted le llega ahí con unos bracos. No, eso es la muerte, right? So, because they really like to be on, they really like to be on fashion, right? So, para los que tienen esos chicos ahí de, de 18 años, right? So, pobre Darwin no puede ir a comprar cualquier zapato del mercado. Tiene que ser la marca, right? So, what, what is the brand for your daughter? Darwin, does she have any specific brand? For my daughter is Adidas. Adidas, so you see. So usted va y le compra uno de esos zapatos de, ¿qué? De... Impossible. No. No, no. Mágicos, by Bracos. No, Bracos de Mágico <laughs> González, no. So teenagers are like that, okay? So I don't know if we have iPhone users right here in this group. Alguien es iPhone user. ¿Quién usa un iPhone aquí? No los conozco, Ticha. <laughs> Rosa Elena. No. Rafael. No, I don't like it. I don't like it. 
Do you use an iPhone, Rafael? No, I don't like. You don't like it? Okay. Nice. Nadie usa iPhone aquí. Florcita dice que usa. Ahí. Flor. Oh my goodness. Ya ven que siempre hay gente pudiente con el en el grupo. <laughs> Why do you use iPhone, uh, Gloria Elizabeth? I use iPhone. But why? Why do you like it? At my work, uh, my my boss um, uh, using the iPhone, and uh, we are connected. Okay, okay. So you use it because of your job. Okay, so. That is uh, an example, right? Most of the people that use an iPhone, so they always say, no, iPhone are better, okay? They are better than Android phones, okay? But you know that they are expensive, right? So let's see, there is another famous brand, for example, um, Starbucks. Do you like a Starbucks coffee? Coffee. Yes. Yeah. Cos café. Yes. <laughs> Clarinero. Yes. Clarinero. Yes. Clarinero. Yes. Pericito. I, I prefer café de olla. Café de olla. <laughs> café de palo. Dice. Café de maestro. Café de maestro. Está. <laughs> yeah. But we, we, say, we say that because we are adults. Usted le pregunta a un adolescente my my daughter oh, yes. que le va a dar usted un café de, de olla para creer que se lo va a tomar no so they are on fashion right so when you when you you, uh, you are in the starbucks that's an expensive coffee so as to know it at starbucks todos los días al menos que pasiva tenga dinero va y tenga como pagarse un café de cinco pesos todos los días o sea you can go there, right? But I guess it's not the case, right? So if you go to Starbucks, so I'm poor, says Ana Michelle. Hmm, Ana Michelle is la que pasa ahí en el Starbucks todos los días. Haciendo tareas, estudiando, trabajando. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah, but if you see Starbucks, so it's a a famous, really famous a brand all over the world. So, los que han hecho testing de ese, de, ese, de ese producto, right? So they love it. So they say, no, a service is delicious. It is expensive, but I like it. Okay, I pay for that. So, I start testing. Y los consumers, como dice ahí la definition, they really prior the product. Okay, so le ponen a usted una Coca-Cola, le ponen una Una salvacola. Mm. Usted se va con la Coca-Cola. Ok. Definitivamente. So, le, entonces usted le digan, ¿qué quiere? ¿Salvacola o Coca-Cola? Hasta la pregunta me ofende, dice usted, right? So, that's how important is the quality, right? So, for the product. Then, what else it says right here? Evaluations on such measures as consumers' relevance. How important is the consumer need being addressed by the innovation, okay? So, cuando usted esté pensando en, en un producto, yo no le estoy diciendo que va a crear un, algo carísimo. A veces uno de algo sencillo, uno puede hacer dinero, right? Make money, okay? But we need to think about, okay? So, yo siempre he dicho de que uno... Puede hacer muchas cosas, right? Pero a veces la mente de no, no nos da para lo que debería, sino que para otras cosas, right? So, but if we used these tips and we really think on something, so we can make money, definitely. But we need to think about the consumer necessity, okay? Innovation, satisfaction, okay? So, que el cliente se vaya feliz, as I told you. Nosotros podemos el día de mañana irnos a poner a una esquina a vender pupusas, right? Uno le voy a decir que me haga la salsa, otro me va a llevar el curtido, otro me va a llevar la masa, otro va a llevar... Yo le echo las pupusas, Pichu. Ok. Yo le 
So Angela will be the pupusera, right? So yes. necesitamos un, el que esté cobrando, que haga bien la cuenta, ¿eh? hacer mala la cuenta. Un buen contador ahí de contar el, el hacerle la cuenta a los customers. Necesitamos quien atienda y todo tiene que ser with high quality, ¿ok? High quality. Le aseguro que hacemos billete. Todo claro lo hacemos sí. bien, todo lo hacemos bien. So customers will be there. But if we are like, ah, esta salsa me quedó salada. Ay, así que se ve. No, soy. Si uno dice, ay, es que las pupusas este, cuadradas las está haciendo Ángel, así cuadradas. ¿eh? Una más Ovalada. grande, una más chiquita. <laughs> no, right? So la gente se fija. They will see the quality, they will see the material, everything. So los clientes ya no nos van a visitar. So in every single product that we think or that we offer, so we need to think about this. Okay, so my goodness, I have to pass the attendance. Interesante teacher, esta clase, muy bonita. Yeah, this is, look, this is what we have in the book, okay? It is talking about product testing, okay? So estoy hablando de esto porque si ustedes ven el, el libro, de esto habla, right? So in, we need to follow the book, okay? So we have these uh, words right here about product testing, but I will pass the attendance, okay? So let me stop sharing for a while. And I'm going to <clears throat> pass the attendance really quick. And then we are going to continue. Um, let's see, Ada Patricia. Here. Thank you, Adriana Stephanie. Present. Ana Michelle. Present. Thank you, Angela. Present teacher. Thank you, Darwin. Present teacher. Thank you, Flor. Present teacher. Thank you, um, Gloria. Here. Nice. Uh, Joanna Patricia. Lourdes Beatriz. Present. Thank you, Margarita Stephanie. Present. Thank I'm you. here. Thank you, Mayra Melanie. Present. Nice. Nelson Edgardo. No. Ofelia Orellana. Here, teacher. Thank you. Osmin Baires. Present, teacher. Thank you. Rafael Ernesto. Present. Thank you. Rosa Elena. Present. Thank, Thank you. you. Sandra Gladys. Teacher. Thank you. Susana Carolina. Present. Thank you. Jancy Lisbeth. Present. Thank you. Sulma Rosaura. Present. Thank you. So, I would like to mention something. Se los iba a decir al inicio y se me fue. So, look. Um, el percentage de la attendance, los, aquí el cuadrito que tenemos acá, eh, ya tiene... O sea, ya tiene una fórmula, right? So, eso no lo saco yo. El cuadro lo saca aromáticamente el percentage de la conexión que usted lleva. Y fíjense que hay algunos que van bastante bien, pero hay algunos que van muy bajitos en el attendance. Lo quiero mencionar para que usted sepa, porque si usted al final no llega al 85%, ya usted ya sabe lo que pasa. Entonces, eh, quiero mencionarles hasta el día viernes. Hasta el día viernes tenemos eh, 40% de asistencia. Ok, 40% de asistencia hasta el día viernes. Ok, so, usted debería de tener 40%. Del 85 mínimo para pasar. Ok, le voy a decir el porcentaje que usted tiene. Del 40% hay solamente, let's see, one, two. Solamente hay dos personas que sí tienen ese 40%. Quiere decir que se han conectado todos los días. Hola, ahí es el vicio, Toda la, espérenme, espérenme, que alguien tiene el micrófono abierto. Ofelia, that's you. 
Okay, so as I told you, eh, dos personas nada más tienen el 40%. Quiere decir que se han conectado todos los días a toda la, la sesión, no se han desconectado. Acuérdese que si usted se desconecta, yo le entiendo, yo veo que algunos me ponen teacher, que se me fue el inter, y yo comprendo, ¿verdad? O sea, yo no voy a decir, mire, ¿por qué? No, ¿verdad? O sea, es algo normal que a cualquiera le puede pasar, pero yo no puedo hacer nada en el cuadro. Yo le pongo si sí si estuvo o si no estuvo. Eso es lo único que yo pongo. El mismo cuadrito, es, las personas de administración, ellos sacan los minutos de conectado de cada uno y ellos lo van poniendo ahí. Eso yo no lo puedo modificar. De hecho, ni me deja el cuadro hacer ningún cambio porque ya hay fórmulas ahí. Entonces, el cuadrito se va llenando solo con los minutos de conexión. Entonces, se lo voy a mencionar así rapidito. Obviamente que hay tiempo para eh, llegar al 85%, right? But it's not mm, something bad if you know what you have. I'm sorry. Ok, let's see. Ada Patricia tiene 37.97. Bastante bien. Adriana Stephanie tiene 32.67. 32.67%, casi 33. Ana Michelle tiene 33.27. Angela, excelente. Usted tiene el 40%, es decir, que usted ha estado en todo. Y Darwin as well, you have 40%. Ok, excelente. Then we have Flor de María, 30.20. Then we have Gloria Elizabeth, 37.83. Bastante bien. Eh, Joana Patricia no está. Lourdes Beatriz tiene 28%. Eh, Margarita Stephanie, Margarita, usted los primeros días se recuerda, ¿verdad? Eso le ha afectado. Entonces, eh, su sí, asistencia, Margarita, yo le recomiendo eh, de una o de otra manera no faltar. Lleva 18.50. No sé si ellos hablaron con usted, o sea, ahí es algo ya administrativo, yo no me puedo meter a más detalles, pero sí le digo, los, los días que usted no se conectó al inicio, pues... Eso es lo que le ha bajado, ¿verdad? Pero ojalá que, que le permitan, porque tiene que conectarse a todos, todos los días, toda la jornada, para ver si llegamos al 80%. Ok. Then we have uh, Mayra Melanie, tiene 34.67. Nelson no está. Ofelia tiene 39.97. Excelente, Ofelia, quizás son... Dos, tres minutitos que no, que no ha estado. Excelente. Osmin, 39.93. Excelente, Osmin. Igual son siete minutos nada más los que por algo motivo se pudo haber desconectado. Pero excelente. Eh, Rafael Ernesto tiene 31.90, casi 32. Eh, then we have Rosa Elena, bastante bien, 39.17, igual, son un par de minutitos los que le hacen falta para llegar a los 40. Sandra Gladys tiene 35.20, más o menos bien, ¿verdad? Está bastante bien. Eh, Susana Carolina tiene 23.90, igual, Susana Carolina, creo que usted es una de las que va más bajitas, trate de... No faltar, siempre conectarse. Yancy Lisbeth, 35.90, bastante bien. Rosulma, Rosaura tiene 28.67, igual. Los que están abajo de 30 o en 30 tienen que conectarse. Ok, so, esto como les digo, quizás no, no debería de decírselos o, o dar esos datos, pero... Pues a mí me interesa que todo, ¿verdad? Este, estén conscientes de eso porque ya se los he dicho aquí, la maestra no aplaza ni pasa a nadie. Aquí esto es eh, individual. Cada uno sabe cuál es el requisito para continuar. No, no son nuevos ustedes, ya saben cómo funciona el programa. Entonces, solo un FYI, ¿verdad? FYI. So, let's continue. Let me share the screen one more time. Vamos a terminar esto.
Okay, so it says uh, build the vocabulary, go online to find out more about uh, key terms related to product testing, write a sentence using each key term. Okay, so estas son terms that we are going to use so that we can use for uh, product testing, right? Cuando estamos hablando de product testing, so we have these words. So let's see if we can get the meaning uh, together. Y aquí, aquí está, miren. Let's see. We have more details here. So estos, vamos a dejar. Let's move on with this ones, okay? So let's see. This is still the number to read the following uh, excerpts about tips to design focus group questions, okay? Aquí vamos ya lo de focus group, que se supone que vamos a hacer uno ahora, okay? So let's see. Help me with the reading. Angela, please. Uh, read the first uh, two lines right here. Okay, teacher. You can help your members have a more productive session by scan, scan questions that grab their attention and get them to provide more honest and complete response. Okay, thank you. Let's see, do we have any new word right here? It says you can help your members have a more uh, productive session, right? By asking questions that grab their attention and get them to provide more honest and complete responses. Do we have any new word right here in this part? Grab. Mm -hmm. Grab, what is this? Grab. Quién sabe qué es grab. Mm -hmm. It's like when you, or in this case, that grab, that grab their their attention. Is when you, uh, is when when someone, uh, no, how can I explain? When make an impression. Mm -hmm. Okay, so um. We say agarrar, si yo traduzco es agarrar, pero lo vamos a poner en el contexto, right? So grab, en este caso to get, to keep, to obtain, okay? To get their attention, para captar, llamar la atención, right? So grab, okay? So si usted lo traduce, as I told you, es como agarrar, pero en este caso no de agarrar así con las manos, sino que you are in a meeting, okay, in front of a lot of people, so you need to ask questions, nice questions to grab their attention, okay, para obtener la atención de las personas, okay, nice. Do we have any other word? I guess no, right? Grab. Okay, nice. Let's see, continue with the uh, reading. Darwin, please, number one. Okay, number one, introduction. Begin the session with a set of questions that will enable focus group members to get to know each other better, AG. Their favorite hobbies and interesting, what they enjoy, focus group, etc. Okay, thank you. It says introduction. Begin the section with a set of questions that will enable, okay, will enable the uh, focus group members to get. Uh, to get to know each other better, better example, uh, their favorite hobbies and interest in uh, what they enjoy, focus groups, etc. So, questions, words, new words, I guess. Enable. Enable, will enable focus group, uh huh. That will enable. What is enable? How we say that work in English, enable. So that is like allow. 
habilitar. Habilitar, permitir. Ok, so that is the, the meaning of that word. So en este caso dice de que hacer, preparar preguntas que permitan, en este caso, que habiliten a los miembros del focus group participar, right? So that would be enable, like ability to, like um, allowed, permitir, right? Nice. Uh, let's see, Ada Patricia, number two, please help us with the reading. Okay, number two, phone started question of activity. Ask a phone question or do a team building game to get the group creative following. For example, ask them to sing of three words to describe their favorite hobby. Okay, thank you. <clears throat> it says a uh, phone a fun start questions or activity okay so it says ask a fun question or do a team building game to get their groups creativity flowing for example ask them to think of three words to describe their favorite hobby hey that's a nice activity so do we have any new word right here in the number two What is team building? So you let the hagamos uh, team building right now. What is that? What is a team building? Team is a group of people. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Now, team if building. you put it together, team building. Como trabajo en grupo de trabajo, equipo de trabajo. Uh -huh. Trabajo en equipo, right? So, ah, pero, en equipo. pero team building es como para construir, right? Una, que haya un equipo armónico, un equipo bonito, Activo. ¿verdad? Donde, exacto, que todos participen, así como ustedes, right? En la clase, que le pregunte a uno, le pregunte a otro, todos van a participar, ni nadie me va a decir... I know you're not, you're not participating, right? So that is a team building game. O sea, una actividad que una, que construya un grupo bonito, okay? So what else? Do we have a number two, something else? Flowing. Uh -huh. Flowing, okay, flowing. Creativity flowing, okay? Como es este que surja, que fluya, que fluya ok, yo le digo, ya vamos a empezar a hacer este focus group, tenemos que pensar en una actividad que haga fluir la creatividad, la imaginación, ok, nice, let's see, um, Gloria Elizabeth, number three, please, ok, format, choosing focus group question, be sure to incline a mix of multiple choice questions to provide a structure and direction and open-ended open question to allow to future exploration and discovery. Okay, nice, thank you, thank you. Number three, the format. When choosing focus group questions, be sure to include a mix of multiple choice questions to provide a structure and direction, uh, open-ended questions to allow for further expl exploration and discovery. Mm -hmm. New words on this? Not really, right? Uh, further for further exploration what is further mm -hmm. further more so what are the further more mm -hmm. hello hello further 
Oh, it say that used to used to emphasize the difference mm -hmm. okay. between a supposed or suggested mm -hmm. fact or state of mind and the truth. Mm -hmm. Okay. A similar word is more like or less like. Mm -hmm. Further, more, more light, less light. So this is like a comparison, right? So further yes. is an adverb, okay? So puede ser algo similar, can be used as an adjective as well. So further es como información, en este caso, allow to further explore, exploration, okay? Que permita... Eh, explorar o descubrir cosas nuevas, ok, further sería como promover, fomentar, permitir, ok, mm -hmm. nice, then we don't have any other word, I guess, so number four, Jancy, please. A writing scale, select an appropriate writing scale, the measure different level uh, of approval. Okay, writing uh, scale, right? Select an appropriate writing scale to make sure, okay? Different levels of approval. I guess there are no new words. We mentioned scale later, uh, before, right? So, habíamos visto eso. Um, yeah, rating is calificar, right? Evaluar. Okay, nice. Uh, continue. Let's see. Uh, Lourdes, Beatriz, number five, please. Okay. A specific city. Specific, right? Specific, specific. Let's see. Especi. My, my goodness. Specify. No, it's not a specify. A specifically. Okay. Specifically. Let's let's look for that meaning. Okay. Let's see. Specificity. Yeah, this one. Specific minims, uniquest. Let me say, I want to see the, the pronunciation of this, pero no me pareció, my goodness. Sounds like specific. Oh my goodness, I listen to Specificity. Uh huh. Aquí está. Specificity. 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 Mm -hmm. Specificity. Specificity. Okay. So Specificity. Avoid vague, open ended question that simply ask why. The word why has a negative meaning. It makes the respondent think. Their first answer was not good. Instead, ask respondents to provide some specific examples of what they like or did not like about the item in question. Mm -hmm. Okay, perfect. Thank you. It says especi, especi, flee. My goodness, aquí lo tengo. It says specificity, specificity. My goodness. Esta está buena, esta palabra, miren. Estarla, estarla diciendo una diez veces, sí. Sí, pero aquí está specificity. Specificity. Ajá, sí, specificity, 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 díganla, specificity, ajá, specificity, vaya, ya la aprendimos, miren, specificity, ajá, it says a boy, a bag you open ended questions that uh, simple as why. The word why has a negative meaning. Oh my God. It makes uh, the respondent think their first answer was not good in, instead. 
as respond to provide some specific example of what they like or did not like about the item in questions. Nice. Do we have any new word right here? Response instead. ¿Qué dijimos? Eso ya lo hemos visto. Instead. Instead. ¿Qué dijimos que era esto? En los primeros días vimos esta palabra. Instead. En su lugar. No. En lugar de. En lugar de. En lugar de. There you go. Ok. En lugar de. Uh -huh. So, entonces dice que hagamos, no se hagan preguntas vagas, es decir, que se le pregunte ¿y por qué? Sino que dice que más bien preguntas que eh, tengan ellos una respuesta con ejemplo de lo que le gusta o de lo que no le gusta. Nice. Let's see the last one, the last part. Vamos a ver a quién no le hemos preguntado. Eh, Ofelia, Ofelia, please, closing. Okay, closely I think I the participant I for her her and us in there and in thing are cool be done to improve a daily experience as a member of the focus group. Okay, nice. Uh, this is the closing. Thank the participants for their help and ask if there anything could be done to improve their experience as a member of the focus group. Okay, so those are like the steps. Okay, so in theory, tenemos que hacer este focus group, pero we will we will see. Okay, we will see if we do it. At, because we need to think in a topic, okay? So, aquí está, mire, work group. So, the idea is design questions, okay? So, seguir esos steps para hacer un focus group, okay? So, el focus group, ustedes lo pueden hacer en su trabajo, en su eh, departamento, hasta en su familia, okay? Usted puede decir, oye, ¿cómo hago...? Eh, un focus group en mi casa. No sé, puede que haya un topic right ahí en común de que, no sé, eh, todos que quieren, digamos, no sé, eh, no sé, pienso como papá, a las 10 de la noche se apagan las luces, todas. No, es que a las 10 no, mejor a las 10 y media. No, que el otro dice, no, es que... Mejor a las nueve. So, se pueden reunir y empezar a hacer preguntas, right? Eh, ¿Qué haces a las diez de la noche? Dijimos que no hay que, no hay que hacer preguntas con why, ¿verdad? Porque suenan negative. You better ask for examples or explanations or examples. So, se ponen a la misma hora, se reúnen y empiezan a escuchar different point of views. At the end, so, the idea of the focus group es que van a llegar a un acuerdo, right? Van a decir, okay, so this is what we are going to do. So, but we take the, we listen all the, the explanations for all the participants. So that's the idea of a focus group, right? To get the best answers, the best resolutions and, <coughs> sorry, to get the decision, okay? So I guess we finished with this, but as I told you, we have, <clears throat> two presentations for today. Go ahead. Eh, podría tomar un screen de eso que estábamos leyendo que no lo alcancé a copiar. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Por Ahorita. favor. Let me see, let me see. This one you mean, right? This one. Ahí, gracias. <coughs> ah, no, pero es que se lo tenemos en el libro, ¿verdad? <laughs> sí, esa, esa es cierto. Sí. Ah, pues no, teacher. Cierto, solo es de estudiar. Okay, okay. Thank you. Thank you. So let me let me share the other presentation porque si no no nos va a dar el tiempo. Okay, so in that way, así terminamos este tema hoy de los focos. So, este es el running. 
running a focus group conversation. So in theory, aquí está eh, la aplicación, right? So we will do just one, two exercise from this part and then we are done. So mañana terminamos lesson number two. Creo que si no tal chance, vamos a empezar number three tomorrow. So I have another definition right here. Remember que I have to follow the, the book. Yo voy en orden. Si se fijan, no me he llevado el libro así como que de la parte del final al inicio. So I'm trying to follow the, the order, right? So in this uh, unit, we continue talking about focus group. Por eso es que te voy a decir, ya aburre eso, pero that's what we have in the book. Okay, that's what we have. So, uh, Rosa Elena, please help us with the reading, this one. A focus group is a small, oh, the question. What is a focus group? A focus group is a small group discussion guided by a trainer leader. Use it to learn more about opinions on, opinions on a designer, designer topic and then guide future action. Mm -hmm. Thank you, nice, Rosalena. So this is the focus group, right? So the idea in the focus group is to have a, a leader, right? So we will have someone that is on charge of like conduct the meeting because if we don't have like a leader, so everyone will be talking at the same time. And the idea is to have someone, right? that can be facilitating the questions, the opinions and everything. We need to have also, we need to have uh, someone taking notes, for example, right? So we need to have someone that can be taking notes, relevant themes. So that's the idea. And at the end, so we will need to take uh, decisions and we get together and we decide what we are going to do. Uh, for the focus group, we have surveys or we have uh, questionnaires, okay? So those are the two famous teams that we can use, okay? So let's see. Um, Adri, Adri, help us read in this first light that we have right here, please. Okay, teacher. Surveys and questionnaires are used to obtain quantitative information about the factors that affect a certain research, research topic. Okay, yeah, it says uh, surveys and questionnaires, okay, are used to obtain uh, quantitative information about the factors that affect a certain research topic, okay? So in the focus group, we need to have surveys, okay? We need to have uh, questionnaire, so we can ask them questions to the participants to try to get the main ideas, okay, for any topic. Uh, let's see, Sulma, help us with the other light, please, this one. Okay, questionnaires are a good method for experimentation. You can modify the information and see how respondents react. Mm -hmm. Thank you. So that is the idea, right? With the, the questionnaires, it says that this is a good method for experimentation. Okay, you can modify the information and see how respond respondents uh, react. Okay, so that's the idea, okay? We will do a, a, a focus group, but we will do something simple, okay? We are going to uh, analyze about a product or something, okay? So how a focus group work, okay? So I have this picture, this picture is not in the book. So this is something that I search on the internet. And it says that different steps, okay? So if you see, we have to determine the topic and goals of the focus group. Esto es lo que tenemos que hacer con el de nosotros, right? So we need to determine the, to the topic, okay? What would be the topic? Uh, we need to identify the potential participants. In this case, the participants are we, okay? Nosotros somos los participants. We have to prepare a guide 
Okay. Uh, the moderator guide or discussions guide that outliers, outlines the focus group questions. Okay. So we need to assign the questions. Then choose a location for the focus group. That is something that we already have because we will do it here in the class. Then it says recruit six to 12 participants who receive an incentive. My goodness, we need prices right here. Then it says conduct a 90 to 120 minute session lead by the trained moderator. So, eso es lo, lo que normalmente va a durar un, un, un focus group, right? Like 90 minutes and 120, okay, the must. And at the end says analyze the section, uh, press uh, in present, ahí hay un es, uh, miss one space, a section in present uh, through a writing or oral report. So as I told you, we have to take notes. So that is the idea, okay? We have a template right here. What is a template? Formato. Mm -hmm. Un formato, right? So this is a template, okay? So when you are trying to do um, a focus group, so you need to have this, okay? So the focus group uh, topic, we need the purposes, we need the participants profile, the focus group questions, and the focus group analysts are conclusions, okay? So that is the idea, okay? So this is the last part. So we have right here, like the steps, okay? Esto es lo que tenemos que hacer. Ya vamos a ver que inventamos. Hay que choose a topic, okay? So we need to, the resection, we need to welcome, conform. That means that we need to start the focus group. Then we have to do arrangements, okay? Concerns, forms, incentives, seating, refreshments. Then we have the introduction. Housekeeping, moderator rules, recording product, introduction, uh, introductions, and tax. Uh, main body, we have the discussion, the agenda, the activities, and the end, that will be the close, the closer, that will be the summaries, questions for the steps. And the post focus group discussion, that will be information, questions, comments, participants, and lead. So, Let's do our focus group, okay? So what we are going to do, let me stop sharing, okay? So the participants, uh, we are the participants. I don't know what happened with my phone. I'm going to restart the phone porque no, no sé, no escucho. So, uh -huh. we have like 20 minutes, less than 20 minutes for the Fox group that we are going to uh, create. So we will do it at just one, okay? So we will do it together because if we divide the class in two, so we will have two focus group and the time it's not enough, okay? We just have like 15 minutes. So what is the step number one? We have two. Uh, choose the topic. So I don't know if you have a topic that you consider that will be interesting for everyone because the participants are the ones that are in this class, in this meeting. So... Mm -hmm. Any idea? Any comment about any topic that we can talk and that can be interesting and that we can um, create questions because that will be the second step, right? As soon as we get the topic, so we are going to start creating, we can do a survey, we can do um, um, questions. Maybe, oh, well, maybe um, the reason because I prefer 
Claro, Movistar, or Vivo, I don't know. Mm -hmm. Okay, like a phone, uh, phone companies. Company, yeah. Phone yeah. companies in, the, in El Salvador. Mm -hmm. That can be a topic, okay. I don't know if we have any other opinion that we can use. Holidays tradition, okay. Sulma is it in the chat. Holidays, and nowadays we are on holidays. <clears throat> okay, I like it that one. I like it that one. Okay, we can talk about Christmas celebration because probably we will have different opinions. We will have people that says, I love Christmas because I like the Christmas tree, because I like the presents, because I like the food. But probably we can have an opinion that uh, someone say, no, I don't like Christmas because that's too much money. We spend too much money on different products that we don't really need. Mm -hmm. Can be, what do you think? We talk about uh, holidays traditions, holiday celebration. Mm -hmm. Raise your hand if you say yes. Raise your hand in the in the app. Reactions. Raise your hand. Holidays, holidays, holidays. Hablemos de holidays, pues, pero hablen. No solo yo, tenemos que hablar todos. Okay, so holidays. Bye. Telephone companies, telephone companies. Quieren hablar de telephone companies or the holidays? My goodness, Osmi. Holidays. Holiday companies. Okay. Holidays. Holidays. Vaya, pues, pero vamos a hablar. Quiero ver si es cierto. Okay. So, holidays. Okay. We have the topic. Okay. We have step number one. Uh, now we need to have a, like a leader. Okay. We need like a leader. That's someone that will be moderating the, the, the focus group, right? The meeting. Any volunteer to be the leader, to be the guide? Ajá, uh -huh. solo uno. If we don't have a uh, volunteer. I choose Rosalena. Okay, so Rosalena. My goodness, Rosalena. So thank you, Rafa. So Rosalena, you are the leader, okay? Oh so you are the one that will handle the questions and everything, okay? Now, we need to write questions, okay? So we can do a mini survey as well. So let me see right here in the chat. Where is the chat? Okay, so we can uh create like a survey what would be if this one is a survey remember the surveys are like simple yes or no okay probably we can put do you um let's see do you celebrate these holidays can be right. Alguien que vaya ahí tomando uh, notes. Vamos a elegir a un secretary. ¿Quién va a ser el secretary? Do you celebrate these holidays? So puede ser una question, right? Como para empezar el, el Fox Group, because Probably we will have people that says, no, I don't celebrate the holidays. I don't like it or, or because of my religion. I don't know. So, puede que salga alguien, right? So, que no, no celebra el holiday. So, 
what else do you think that can be a good question for a survey? Ahorita estamos haciendo un survey, no es un questionnaire. Solo es un survey, como do you celebrate a holiday, yes or no? Okay, Sulma, where? Where do you celebrate the holidays? Okay, where? Preguntas así cerradas, right? Where? Ah, in my house, in my grandparents' house. So Darwin, you are the, the one that is taking notes, okay? Vayan tomando nota de las, de las questions que vamos a hacer para la survey, okay? So ya llevamos dos. Do you celebrate the holidays? Where do you celebrate the holidays? Ajá, uh -huh. pueden escribir ahí en el chat, okay? Otra preguntita. When, when do you celebrate holidays? Mm -hmm. But when that would be now, right? Porque estamos en la Navidad, o sea, es como en esta época, right? So, tal vez una pregunta más. Mm. ¿Qué hacen? How do you, how do, mm -hmm. how do you do? What do you do? A esa sí, pero esa sería buena para el questionnaire. Anote Darwin, ok? Esa, what do you do on holidays? Esa puede ser para el questionnaire. Porque vamos a hacer una survey y un questionnaire. What's different, teacher? Remember que el survey es una encuesta, right? Cuando la gente solo responde, pero no vamos a hablar nada. Y el questionnaire, y el questionnaire, ese sí nos tiene que explicar la persona cuando le preguntemos, right? So they have to explain more. Okay, like, what do you do? Oh, I cook. At home, delicious food. I always cook dinner for me and my family and blah, blah, blah. So I empiezo una explicación, right? So oh. uh -huh, we have um, from Susana. Do you eat chicken in holidays? Okay, eso está buena para la survey, right? So do you eat chicken? Porque no todos comen pollo, otros comen... Beef. Guajolote, right? Guajolote. So, otros comen, no sé, otros comen peligüey, venado, qué sé yo, right? Osmin, ¿qué come por ahí? Usted debe comer ahí un su, no sé. Un relleno, su... ¿cómo se dice el, el rabo? Only chicken. Only chicken. <risa> relleno, what you mean with relleno? Pero cuando hace la carne rellena que la meats, meats, uh -huh, meat, pero no meat. sé cómo, porque la carne rellena, el lomo relleno, lomo relleno, so es, carne be... roja, es carne roja, entonces no sé cómo se le dice. Permit. Lomo relleno, I guess it's the same. Lomo relleno. It says a stuff, a stuff it loin. And so we'll put it right here in the chat. <clears throat> I don't know why I feel like como que me quiere doler la garganta. Stuff it, loin. Okay, it's there in the chat. Hey, Surma, you have another question. So, esta la notó, right? Darwin, do you eat uh, chicken in holidays? And this one, do you cook in holidays? So, how many do we have? Ya llevamos, how many for the survey? Yes, in this moment, read uh, four questions. Okay, so four are enough, okay? Suficiente with four for the survey. So now we need the questions for the uh, questionnaire. I guess this one can be nice. So we have one for the questionnaire, right? The one that's the one that mentioned Sandra. What do you do? Okay, what do you do on holidays? And this one, I guess it can be also a question for the a uh, questionnaire, do you cook in holidays? 
Y ahí vamos a preguntarle qué cocina, ¿no? Y ahí se sale la conversación. Ese es cuestión. Uh -huh. Do you cook in holidays? That would be a question. Okay. Eh, la eh, question two de de encuesta. For the survey. So for the Ajá, we for the have. How many do we have, Darwin, for the survey? Excuse me, teacher. How many uh, questions do we have for the survey? Uh, the one, what do you do holiday? Mm -hmm, but no, what do you do? That is for the questionnaire. Quest uh, the questionnaire? Do you celebrate this holiday first? <clears throat> no, that one is for the survey. The survey? Mm -hmm. Do you celebrate? That is for the yeah. survey. Sorry. What uh, else do we repeat. have? Mm -hmm. What do you celebrate this holiday? Is the service. Mm -hmm. Number two, where do you celebrate the holiday? Mm -hmm. Number three, do you eat chicken in holiday? Mm -hmm. Okay. And number, and number four, do you cook in holiday? Mm -hmm. So in that case, we say that that one will be for the questionnaire. So we have three questions only for the survey. Okay, vamos a hacer una más para la survey. I have another, another oh, question. Okay, Anna Michelle. Yes. Um, maybe uh, do you drink alcoholic beverage in holiday? Mm, nice. Okay. Do you drink alcohol drinks? Uh huh. Drink. Do you drink alcohol, alcohol drinks? So I don't this. Do you drink? Alcohol, mm. drinks, ahí va de todo, va. During Drink. the holidays. No vayan a agarrar zumba. Do you drink, teacher? Do you, no, do you teacher, drink alcohol son. drinks? Alcohol ¿Alco? drinks, ajá. Or a beverage, can be, right? So, sin para que no suene ahí como drink, drinks. Ah, Puede alcohol. ser, do you drink alcohol, beverage, during the holiday? Uh -huh. Uh -huh. So, ahí va de todo, va todo lo que tenga piquete para arriba. Piquete de lo mío. During the holiday. So... Um, dejamos esta para la survey o para el questionnaire. Como cuestión. Entender. Mejor en esa pienso yo. Uh -huh. Ya, yeah, ok. Dejemos esta entonces como question for the questionnaire. Do you drink? Entonces siempre llevamos, creo que ya vamos con tres y tres, right? Tres. Sí, sí. Uh -huh. So we have, we need one more, okay? Necesitamos una más para el questionnaire y una más para what, la survey. What dessert do we have in the holiday? In the holiday? Can be desserts. Es bien común, right? Past ese día, que ese día ni las cosas caben en la refri, va. Tanta That's comida. Good. El Teacher, Susan, write in the chat one question. Let me see, let me see. Ah, how many people will arrive in the holidays? Ajá, sí, aquí hay otra vez, Susana. Are traditions in your family for Christmas? Ah, esta la podemos dejar para questionary. Which, ok, aquí sería como which, oh. cuáles, ok. Which are, ok, which are the traditions, ok, which are the, <clears throat> my goodness, sorry, que siento que me estoy quedando fónica. Which are the traditionals in your family, ajá. Uh -huh. 
está usted comiendo de las 12 uvas en la medianoche. Okay, so which are uh, the traditionals in your family? Okay, deje esa para el questionnaire porque esa da uh, una respuesta. For okay, Christmas no. mail, for Christmas mail, or solo your family. Okay, yeah, for Christmas, okay, ahí yo no le puse, pero which are the traditionals in your family for Christmas, okay. Eh, y aquí había otra de Ada Patricia. Um, how many people will arrive in the holidays? Mm -hmm. Okay, so we can leave this one for the Serpy. How many people will arrive in your family, right? So how many people will arrive in your family uh, for holidays or in the holidays? Okay, so algunos lo vienen a visitar, ¿verdad? Viene el hermano lejano y le trae los grandes zapatotes de Navidad. ¿Esa sería question o, o service? Teacher? Esta quedaría para service. Este, how many people will arrive to your family or to your home or house in the holidays, right? So, allí a su casa, ¿cuántos lo van a llegar a visitar? Toda la familia, teacher. Uh -huh. Yeah, sometimes no necesariamente que van a venir de allá del norte, ¿va? Así es. They can be from, they can be from outside the San Salvador. Llega y lo, lo visita de hasta el de Chalate. De Chalate, <laughs> del norte, right? So lo visitan de Jan Miguel, lo visitan de... <laughs> todos los lugares. So now we have four and four, right, Darwin? We have four for the questionnaire. We have four for the... Um, Serbi, and we have three minutes only, ok, so mañana vamos a empezar, ya saben cuáles son las preguntas, entonces de eso vamos a hablar, no vamos a venir hablando de, de otra cosa, ok, so la Serbi vamos a buscar un analista, ya vamos a ver ahí a quién nos contratamos mañana, porque la Serbi la vamos a mandar, ya vamos a ver cómo la mandamos y todos la tenemos que responder, y ahí vamos a ver quién sí celebra, quién no, y después vamos a ver las conclusiones. Ok, so that's the idea, right? So get the answers, so see the analysis. Ya vamos a contratar aquí un analista de, de, de data, un analista de, de las, del questionnaire que vamos a, bueno, que Rosa va a dirigir, right? Quién va, quién le va a preguntar y everything, ok, ahí. <risa> Le vamos a poner un assistant a Darwin ahí para que le ayude con el writing, ok? So, we will do it tomorrow. At least ya tenemos el paso dos, right? So, ¿se acuerdan que venimos los pasos del, del focus group, right? So, ya tenemos un leader, ya tenemos la survey, ya tenemos el questionnaire. So, tomorrow, the, the, the day, the place, eso ya lo tenemos porque es aquí en la clase, right? Si no tuviéramos que buscar a dónde. Y a qué horas nos reunimos, right? So, digamos que step number three ya lo tenemos. So, vamos a la ejecución, okay? Tomorrow, the focus group, okay? And then we need to analyze, okay? What we is need... the teacher? Step number one is choose the leader and choose the topic. Ya lo tenemos. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay, my goodness, I have to pass the attendance, okay? So, just give me... One moment right here. The topic, then. Yep. Uh, let's see, Ada Patricia. Present. Thank you. Uh, Stephanie. Present, teacher. Thank you, Michelle. Present. Thank you, Angela. Present, teacher. Nice, Darwin. Present, teacher. Nice, Floor. Present. Thank you, Gloria. Yes. Thank you, Joanna. Uh, Lourdes. Present. Thank you, Margarita. I'm here. Thank you, uh, Mayra Melanie. Present, teacher. Thank you, Nelson. No vino. Uh, Ophelia. 
Thank you, Osmin. Present teacher. Thank you, Rafael. Present. Thank you, Rosa Good night. Elena. Good night. Present. Thank you, Sandra Gladys. Present. Thank you, Susana. Jancy Lisbeth. Present. Thank you, Sulma Rosaura. Present. Okay, so let's see. ¿Quién se va a quedar ahora conmigo? Quiero ver. Joana Patricia no está. Gloria ya, ya nos quedamos. Perdón, Gloria. Lourdes Beatriz. ¿Quién, ¿Quién se quedó conmigo el viernes? El viernes, perdón, me quedé con usted. Uh -huh. No, es que es como no estaba Joana y otra vez no está. Eh, Margarita. Está malita de salud, me dice, ¿verdad? La vamos a dejar descansar ahora para que se recupere. Eh, Mayra Melanie. Estuve el jueves, tita. ¿Verdad? Usted se quedó el jueves, sí. Que ya, sí. ya, a ver. Porque ese día no estaban también en los dos anteriores. Nelson, Nelson no está. Ofelia, mire, llegamos hasta donde usted, Ofelia. Falta Nelson, me va a quedar Margarita, Joana, pero igual, ¿verdad? Margarita vamos a ver mañana, ¿ok? Ofelia. Ok, Ofelia, me permite ahí, quiero ver, ahí está. Sí, hay unos, unos siete minutitos más, ok, ya les robé dos minutos a todos. So, uh, thank you for being here. So, ahí tal vez el secretario, si le queda tiempito, comparta lo que tenemos para que ya todos vengamos un poquito estudiados con las preguntas de lo que vamos a tratar en nuestro focus group, ok. Uh, ok, so mañana lo vamos a desarrollar y cómo nos va a salir a saber, pero lo vamos a hacer, ok. So, thank you and I hope to see you tomorrow, ok. So, sí. see you tomorrow. Bye, bye. Thank, thank you, teacher. Good night. Good night, everyone. Bye. Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night. See you tomorrow. Tomorrow. Bien. No le voy a robar mucho tiempo, Fede, solo permítame unos minutitos. Ahí tiene su bebé, ya vi. Ok, creo que ya casi me falta. ¿Y por qué los tres los vamos a quedar? Creo que sí. Ay, <risa> te vas a quedar un ratito, pero no creas que castigado. No, estás sí. castigado, solo tenemos que conversar un poco. ¿Cómo te llamas? Anthony. Anthony. Anthony, mira qué bonito tu nombre, Anthony. ¿Y cuántos años tenés, Anthony? Cinco. ¿Y? Cinco. Wow, está súper grande, Anthony. ¿Y por qué no te ha dormido, Anthony? Porque estoy con mi mamá. Estás esperando a tu mamá hasta que ella, hasta que ella sale, te dormís. Sí. Y ya no, y estás yendo a estudiar o ya saliste. Sí, ya salí. De kinder. De kinder. Sí. O sea que el otro año vas a ir a prepa. Sí, sí. Sí. Wow. Solo él tiene. Sí, solo él tiene. Suficiente. <risa> Suficiente con Anthony. Valiente Anthony. Mire, la espera hasta las 10 de la noche. Bien. Bueno, Felia, no le voy a quitar mucho tiempo. No sé cómo, cómo se siente usted en las clases, en el grupo. ¿Cómo eh, ve? ¿Qué le ha parecido? Eh, me parece excelente porque... Estoy aprendiendo más porque como hoy se habla más, antes solo se, digamos, se hacía diálogo, hoy es más, más creativa la, la clase. 
Uh -huh. Sí, no, esa es la idea, ¿verdad? Esa es la idea, que ustedes tienen que eh, participar, ustedes tienen que hablar un poquito más, aunque a veces nos cueste o nos dé pena, pero tenemos que, tenemos que buscar ahí la forma de, de participar y, y estar pendiente de, de, de cada una de las actividades de alguna o de otra manera. Yo, como les he dicho, pues... Sé que no es fácil porque, pues sí, el cansancio y todo eso, ¿verdad? Del día, pero eh, trato la manera de que ustedes puedan eh, participar, ¿verdad? Participar. Usted con la asistencia va súper bien. No sé cómo va con el trabajo de la plataforma. Sí, me faltan unas cosas de la plataforma que no me las agarra, no me las reconoce. Pero yo quizá me he equivocado. Algo, una cómoda, espacio. Sí, como ahí, o, sea, o a veces si va mayúscula, minúscula, todo eso se lo, sí, se lo corrija. Ya casi dice varias, pero hay una de contestar las ha dejado porque no me las agarra, pero sí. tengo que revisar una por uno para ver cuál me agarra. Uh -huh. Ok, cualquier cosa que necesite de la plataforma o algo que no tenga muy claro, me puede escribir ahí para poderle ayudar, ¿verdad? No, está bien, dicho. No sé si tendrá usted alguna duda, alguna pregunta o algo en relación al, a las clases. Hay, hay unas cosas que, 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 que no entiendo, que se me olvidan, pero yo me tengo que aprender los verbos para entender más. Uh -huh. Sí, eso de los verbos, eso sí, como uh -huh. yo se los he dicho, lastimosamente no hay una fórmula mágica, sino que uh -huh. hay que estudiarlos. Y usted trabaja todo el día, todos los días. Día ¿Y a dónde trabaja usted? En Santa Tecla, en Pavesa. Es una constructora. ¿eh? Ah, ok. ¿Y qué, sí. a qué, qué hace usted dentro de la compañía? Ahí en contabilidad, ¿sí? Es la contadora. ¿eh? Ah, vaya, mira, sí. usted nos va a sacar los números mañana. Sí, mañana nos va a sacar los números. De la, de la encuesta que vamos a hacer. Sí. Bien, bueno, Ofelia, gracias entonces por el tiempo y, y pues sigamos adelante, ¿verdad? Y cualquier cosa ustedes me pueden escribir, me pueden decir, estoy ahí para poderles ayudar y con la asistencia, pues usted va súper bien, siga así, trabajando con la plataforma para que no vaya a haber eh, ningún problema al final, ¿verdad? Sí. Bueno, pues gracias entonces gracias. por el tiempo, Ofelia, pasa buenas noches. Buenas Anthony, noches. ya te puedes ir a dormir. ¿Eh? Bye, Anthony. Bye, bye. Bye. Bye, bye. bye. <ríe> Buenas noches. Good Buenas night. noches. Good night.